Tuesday, July 2nd, 2 p.m. Mountain Time, 2019. Special day down in the Southern Hemisphere as they are witnessing a total solar eclipse. Today, July 2nd, 2019 in South America through Chile, San Juan, Buenos Aires, Southern Uruguay. The eclipse is underway right now as I do this video. I'll post a link down below in the description box where you can watch the total solar eclipse in its entirety. I want to show you something here at the GO-17. It's a very unique sequence of events that you're about to see here in real time. You're going to see the shadow of the new moon as it's making its way across the South Pacific for a rendezvous with the sun creating the total solar eclipse. I want to show you that again in slow motion here one step at a time. See the shadow of the moon? That's the new moon going across the southern Pacific Ocean, which directly above it in the northeast Pacific Ocean is a major hurricane, a Category 4 storm. Looks like the yin-yang. You've got the white hurricane above the equator, and you've got the dark shadow of the new moon. And you can see the new moon details here at moongiant.com at the website MrMBB333.com under the moon phase tab. But this is a rare occurrence. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this on this satellite instrument where I have a major hurricane directly above shadows of the moon. And this is a unique sequence of events where we have a new moon shadow directly below a major hurricane in the Pacific Ocean. The hurricane is making its way towards Hawaii. It will be there by the first part of next week. The hurricane should not make any type of significant landfall. If it does, it will be mild. I don't think it will be any type of storm or at least organized storm when it does reach the Hawaiian Islands. It is projected to go in that direction, though. All of the models are in agreement, and we're going to take a look at that right now. This is when the storm first became a major storm less than 12 hours ago. That is a Category 4 storm. Here's the models, and they are all pointing towards the general direction of the Hawaiian Islands by Tuesday of next week. Could make a direct impact into the Hawaiian Islands as some sort of a tropical system, but more than likely not an organized major hurricane by any means. The water is much too cool and the trade winds are much too strong. But right now, this thing is forecasted to at least become, within the next 12 hours, possibly a Category 5 storm with winds of above 150 miles per hour. Here's a look at the storm as it became a major hurricane. Another look at it here at the GO-17 where I just showed you the moon shadow. This is also as the storm became a major Category 4 storm. And that is a very well-organized large system making its way west towards the Hawaiian Islands right here. So the storm is projected to go slightly north right now. It's at around the 14 degree north latitude, just above the equator. Down below the equator, we have the moon shadow making its way towards South America for a rendezvous with the sun, creating a total eclipse. Rare event that does not happen very often. You can find the total eclipse, a link to watch the event in its entirety down below in the description box. Like I said, once again, it's already underway, about to reach totality anytime. Thanks for watching. Have a super day and be safe out there.